Hello. I'm here with another video, uh, or another tutorial related to magic again. This is a flourish, so it's not a trick this time. Uh, what's a flourish? A flourish. Sorry, the TV's on. A flourish is a um, set of moves which you can do, which you can add to your routine or a magic trick, which make it look a whole lot more beautiful, make you look a lot more professional, and it just makes it, it makes everything look a lot, a lot better. It makes any trick look better. Okay, so this is a coin flourish. If you do any coin magic, or if you use coins in any trick, or if you can just do it anyway because it looks so cool, um, yeah, this is definitely something you, you want to add to your routines. It's called a coin roll. You've probably seen already, this is what it looks like. Very cool move. Alright. This trick is a lot harder than the other video I put up. It's going to take quite a bit of practice, but it's definitely worth it, as you can see. So, um, get a coin, and let's learn this. Be prepared to drop the coin a lot. You will drop it a oh. lot. It's very naggy, you're going to be dropping coins all the time. At least I was. Okay, so you're going to hold your hand like this, this is the hand position. The coin is going to roll over this part of your fingers here. Okay, it's not going to roll over the bones like that. It's not going to roll over the front. This part here. Okay, so that's the part that needs to be flat. Yeah? And you can tilt it slightly, but you don't want to tilt it down or up. Okay? So, keeping this flat. You're gonna keep. You're gonna have your hand relaxed. You don't want to do the coin roll like this. It's not gonna work. It's gonna look good. Yeah. Keep your hand relaxed. So you're gonna start with the coin balanced on your thumb. Keep it there. Make sure you can get it. Make sure you got the balance. Yeah. Then you're gonna flip it onto your first finger. Okay. You take it. Flip it. Just stay there. See it? That's what you don't want. Sorry, moved it too much. Okay, so it should stay balanced there. And then you clip it with your middle finger. Like that. Okay. So there you go. From there. Clip it to there. And you can push it. If it's a little bit wonky like it was before, you can just straighten it out with the other fingers. Okay. Then, you can use your first finger to help with this. Clip it again. See how I kind of pushed it with my first finger? until it gets the fourth finger. So let's do this again. So you're balancing it on your thumb, flip it onto your first finger, clip it, clip it again. Now here, this is where, this is the first thing we're going to do. You're going to scoot the coin with your first finger like that. We'll do a little finger like that. Okay? So it gets into this, this position. You can even use your third finger to help. Show you again. It's balanced on your fourth finger. Scoop it down. Now it's fallen to that gap, see? That's where it is. Now your thumb comes underneath and just takes it from there. And then you're ready to start again. You go all the way down. Then, see, look, my third finger is kind of pushing it into that gap, helping because the little finger can't really do it on its own. So the middle finger kind of pushes the coin through that gap. And just clip it there, thumb comes underneath ready to go back again. And all of a sudden, you've got your coin roll. Now, be prepared to practice this. Uh, because it does take a lot of practice. I'm practicing this phrase, and as you can see, I'm still dropping it. So, don't worry about it. Now, something you want you might want to learn as well as, at the same time, uh, I haven't actually, I've only really just started learning this, is to go all the way along to the end, and you can get it, just like with all the others, onto your little finger, and then just pass it over. Put it there. And do the same thing on your left hand. So I'm just going to grab it with these two fingers. Like that. So you can do it on the hands. But I'm not quite hitting my left hand yet, so that's what it looks like. Um, yeah, definitely practice this one. It's worth doing. It is very naggy. You will probably want to kill this coin because you're going to drop it so many times. But uh, you'll get it, trust me. That's the coin roll. Here's one more time. All right. That's probably.